this is the voice of Dylan Flynn. Hi, this is the voice of Trevor Ickrath. And you're listening to Wordle with Friends, the show where two friends do the Wordle. Back to business as usual today, Dylan, and I got to say I'm quite thankful for it. Uh, I'm excited for this course correction after yesterday's Murphy's Law edition of Wordle with Friends, where literally anything that could go wrong did go wrong. You haven't been spoilered. For today's answer and to make sure the same doesn't happen to our listeners we should say that we're about to perform wordle which one is it it's uh well today of course is sunday march 27th 2022 trevor and i are about to attempt to solve wordle number 281 so this is your warning to turn back now if you've not yet done today's puzzle because there will be spoilers ahead do you want me to go first today? I guess it's kind of weird, right? Like, I think yesterday, technically, I would have gone first, but then Maxton did. So let's I, just... don't, I don't think we should worry about it too much. I didn't go first yesterday, so yeah. Why don't, why don't you go first? I'm going to plug my first word in right now. And I got five gray letters from playing the word grift. G-R-I-F-T, I would assume. That's right. Yeah. Kind of feel like I've been grifted by the game or by my own impulses. Okay, well, I'm going to try to play... Uh five completely different letters and not play any overlaps let's see if i can make that happen all right okay here we go let's see i played i think five different letters from you but i only got one yellow letter i just played the word uncle uncle yeah you did play all different letters from me but i only got one yellow from it okay let's see if i can think of a word that has plenty of different letters in it too i wonder what that yellow one is though Ooh. okay i just played uh coals as in, like, what, you shovel into a furnace? Sure. And I got five gray letters. Wow. Yeah. For coals? Yeah. Okay, so then we've ruled out a lot of vowels. That means we got to be looking at a Y, I assume. I guess so. All right. Let me, well, let me look at the grid and try to think. This is the bleakest board I've seen in a while. This is rough, man. Yeah. We've ruled out A, E, I, O, and U. <laughs> what is this word? And it has an N. Oh, I just gave that away. Sorry. Whatever. You were going to find out this round anyway. Yeah, I was. It's not a big deal. Oh, no. How long am I going to be sitting here (laughs) trying to figure this out? I don't know. You might have to do a fact-finding mission. Fortunately, I feel like it might be so narrow a window that if you do commit to trying to solve it this turn, I feel like you have to get it. I'm going to try to just make a list of words that only have the letter Y in them to see if I can get there. This is a bad one, though. This is uh, we yesterday we had epoxy, and now this. Yeah. Are they trying to? Are they trying to to sundown this whole wordle thing? Like, let's just shut it all down, right? Don't want people to enjoy their weekends too much. Good lord. Okay, the weekend from hell. Oh, I just got. I just thought of a word that doesn't use any of the vowels we've disqualified, but it also uses a letter that I I know is not in the word. I was gonna play pygmy. Oh, pygmy. Yeah, but that G from Grift, that rules that yeah, out. That G. Hey, hang on. I'm I know that it cannot be tryst because we've ruled out T and S. T and R and S. And R, yeah. yeah. Pretty much all of those letters. Yikes. Oh my god. Do I have one that works? It's gotta be it. I feel like it has to be it. Hang on, let me check it. What was your last round's play? Coles. Coles. And then I started with Uncle. You started with Grift. Mm-hmm. <laughs> this must be the solve this is such a bad word to answer on the same level of epoxy okay here i'm about to press enter here we go five green letters round two <sighs> i don't even know where to start this is two days in a row <laughs> uh, well i i hey at least i let you know which of my letters was yellow so you've got that going for you i feel like it doesn't help me at all oh i know what this word is i think yeah okay nymph it's a nymph yeah that's not that's a tough answer for a Wordle game, but I mean, that's not on the same level as epoxy for me. Well, maybe that's because epoxy is like a uh, Tim Allen building a house man word. And it's then- like s- such a specific category of a thing, you know, like I would expect that to be like a brand almost rather than like an actual like noun. Okay, but one could argue that, like, you know, the fairies in the woods is a pretty specific brand of noun as well. Yeah, I don't know. It's j- maybe just the fact that I'm sure that word appears somewhere in like the works of shakespeare whereas like i would doubt epoxy does are you up by two now or i think i'm up by two now i was one ahead and then i'm up by two i don't think yesterday's scrimmage counted towards the total did it no wow and i've got four days to tie it back up huh yeah it's getting tight for you here in march but the real loser today was josh wardle for picking bad words two days in a row i would agree hey if you want to uh 
follow us uh, on social media, you can. On Twitter, we are Wordle Friends. Our TikTok is really howling right now. Go on over to TikTok and look for us, Wordle Friends, on there. Much love to the TikTokers showing us support. Oh, yeah. Love those TikTokers. Yeah. If you are from TikTok and you find your way over to our YouTube page by typing Wordle with Friends into YouTube, be sure to comment on our video something like, is anybody else here from TikTok? We love seeing that. Yeah, we like to know. If you want a more direct and private form of uh, of communication with the show, though, you can always send us an email to Wordle Friends at gmail.com as far as i know that's everything so for now i've been dylan flynn i've been trevor ickrath and we'll see you back here tomorrow on the show where friend is a five-letter word nailed it This has been a production of The Lighthouse Keepers Company. Culture Illuminated.